Lindsay and I was president of my class freshman and sophomore year. And as a leader in my student government, my advice for the next president of the United States is to use the platform you're given for good. Don't let opposition affect the way you govern yourself nor govern other people and embrace who you are, don't fight it. I personally was inspired to run for class office due to the women that came before me. If we look back 100 years ago, women were in the suffrage movement fighting for the simple right to vote. Now fast forward to modern day and women are given the opportunity to run for the highest office, whether it be in school or for President of the United States. Hi, my name is Lexi Boynes and I'm co-president of the SRQ Volunteer Board. And some of the qualities and skills that I've learned as being president, one would be never to show your fear to the general public as they put you in charge. And if you're scared, then they're scared. The second would be to remain one step ahead of the game. That way no one or nothing can take you by surprise and any advice I'd have for the future female president potential of the United States would be to always be detailed about your plans and proposals so that no one or nothing can also take you by surprise. And also remember to smile, because even when you're down, you're never really down. Hi, I'm Marissa Brott, and I was president of my class sophomore year. There are two main things I learned being president, and the first is, is that success is believing in yourself. There are so many times that other people doubted me, but I kept pushing, because at the end of the day, the effort you put in early on can make a big impact in the future. Another thing I learned is that you need to gather public support. If everyone else doesn't believe in you, then even if you believe in yourself, your plans won't go through. Another tip I have for any future women presidents out there is that you can be even successful as a man is because you can gather support from men and women in the community. Hi, I'm Sophia Cartaya and I'm the co-president of the SRQ Volunteer Board. As co-president, I have learned a few things. First, listen to the advice of others. They can often offer some insight that you may not have thought of yourself. Second, do what you know is right. Working to make everyone happy is a nearly impossible task. Also, if the next president of the United States is a female, my advice to you as a female president myself would be that if misogynists try to get in your way, crush them.